Hi, in this video I will show you how to create a jump for your character in any scratch game. It can be just simple jump game when your character should when you should jump and don't touch some obstacles like a dinachron like a dinachrome game or it could be a platformer. So I just show you the principle how you can create a jump script. Let's just add background. It will be easy that we have uh, some ground. We can create a very simple script for a jump. For example, let's when the space key pressed, we have a y coordinate. It's um, vertical. Let's like a vertical line. So if you want that our cat go up we can change y but then like yes or you can create just for example yes it it looks like a jump okay and when you go down you can go down again and if you create it in a move you will need like for example you repeat 10 times go by 10 up yes and then you repeat going down so let's try i press space and yes my cat is jumping and it's pretty okay if you're new in scratch but it's not like in real life because you see when you go up, first it's stuck here. Yes, it's like stuck, push the sky, stuck in the sky. And then go down, yeah? It's a, um, this movement is very linear, but in the real life, we jump, we go down and in the top, our speed is zero and then because of the gravity we falling down and our speed increase again with, with the force we jump our speed increase and then it decreases until zero and then because of gravity we falling down to the ground again so let's create a more complicated script so we will create a variable speed and and when the green flag clicked so we will check first we need check if we touch in the ground it uh, the ground you can check if you create another uh, sprite for the ground or just chicken color for our example let's just try touching color the ground this brown and so if we touch on ground our speed is zero yes we're not falling we're not jumping our speed zero but if i'm not touching so it means that i'm jumping i'm somewhere in the sky my speed should change by minus one so it's always should decrease because we need fallen and and we always need change our y coordinate by this speed you see if i put my cat it's falling down and when i touch the ground it's zero great and let's add jump so it could be just another if we press paste yes you can use these blocks but in more complicated games if you want to be a great creature just try to use if conditions and we need we'll be able to jump when we touch the sky uh, when we touch the ground so 
and if k space press so if we jump we just need to set speed let's 15 for example so we increase our speed and then fall down let's try yes you see we can because we still touching color and it's a conflict between these two conditions so we need just a little change why let's just try five for example so that we not touching ground and our script will work you see great great we have a jump and it's all physical it's look better than this let's just compare again for example this script how we jump you see and this one oh <laughs> yes <laughs> and this one if you want to jump higher you can just change the value here <laughs> also we can put this in additional block we can create my block if you don't know how to use my blocks watch my another video the link in description and somewhere here and let's call it just jump we need to define this block so i can just put this and in forever just put jump block and it's still working so great our cat can jump thank you for watching this video please write in the comments if this video will helpful for you i hope you enjoyed See you next time. Bye.